our 22 day road trip across South Africa. So we're pretty much spanning the entire country. First we drove, Kipo's behind me, if you hadn't noticed. First we drove about nine hours from Cape Town to Kilfontaine, which is this little farm in the middle of nowhere. And then we drove seven hours to Johannesburg. And then finally we drove seven hours to this, which is Sabi River Sun. stay on this bungalow just next to the Sabi River, which is filled with crocodiles and hippos. And what's so amazing about it is you're kind of coexisting with them. So they're just, I mean, you walk out of your front door and you have hippos. Welcome to Sabi River Sun, our workstation. Yeah, our room's a little messy, but... And the best part about it is our backyard. Okay, correct me if I'm wrong in the comments or whatever, um, but I think hippos are the animals that kill the most humans in Africa, which is pretty crazy since they don't seem all that dangerous, but they're actually massive. They can weigh up to three tons and they run, they can run up to 30 kilometers an hour on land. Something that's iconically Sabi is going hippo watching. And the reason why we get to see them so up close is that the river actually runs through the resort. So I've never really been a big bird person, but ever since I started filming and making videos, you really start to notice the little things. I started paying attention to the birds. We have seen maybe 50 different types of birds. Oh, you're an ugly guy. this chicken that's been roaming around. I kept on seeing it and no one else was seeing it. And now, there's proof. There's this little baby hippo that I'm dying to get a video of, but it just won't come out of the water. When we take out the camera, they literally stop and stare at you. It's certainly very peaceful here, but at the same time, it is super chaotic. I mean, listen to the noise that these birds make. That goes on 24-7. And then the hippos. Oh my god. It's hard to explain what they sound like. Yeah, we'll try capture it. <laughs> They've got those big teeth and those big tusks. 
But what's really interesting is they, they graze, so they don't actually use them to hunt or anything. It's more for defense and for shows of dominance. Yeah, hippos are actually vegan, surprisingly. Hippos and the beautiful wildlife isn't entertaining enough, so we have to buy a toy plane. No. <laughs> All right, it's time to go and find some sticks to roast marshmallows. Oh my god. <laughs> 